there. We know you eat a lot of noodles. Anyway, that's besides the point. Let's talk some things to do with logistics. Players in the logistics business are arbit following the directive to revert cargo operations back to the port of Mombasa. This new directive means it will no longer be mandatory to use the SGR cargo to ferry your goods to Nairobi. This will now be an optional development that could significantly affect SGR revenue streams. What the president said yesterday, which uh, it is an executive order, we are very happy about it because Mombasa's economy was dwindling and uh, there was a lot of problems that we were encountering because most of our people had gone out of work. Most of our transporters were crying just due to the fact of uh, the forced clearance at Nairobi and Naivasha. But now, with the fact that now the president has said that all the operations are supposed to be done in uh, Mombasa, we are very happy. Actually, what we need is not even the operations to be transferred to Mombasa, but each and every importer should be given an opportunity to clear the cargo where they want. Kwa hakika tumeteseka sana kazi ilipotoka hapa mpaka Nairobi. Mpaka mimi ofisi yangu ikabidi nifungue ofisi pale Nairobi, nimekuwa a very big cost on that. Kwa lakini kile naomba rais ni kwamba akae na cabinet yake pale chini, waandikisha hiyo paperwork ndio inaitwa circular. Because akiongea pale jana, hiyo ni mambo ya mongea pale. Lakini angalia wale wanaivasha. Manake pale pia government me invest pesa mingi sana. Asije katoa wale pale wako na familia all right reactions from traders on the ground on matters relocating clearing you know business back to mombasa port and people from naivasha especially those who are banking on the internal